All right, so here's our I can statement. It says, I can use a circular protractor to understand a one degree angle, one 360th of a turn. All right, also explore benchmark angles using a, the protractor, okay? So let's talk about this a little bit, see what we're talking about, all right? So a circular protractor, okay? First of all, protractor, you may or may not have heard of that before. But I'm sure if you have older brothers and sisters, you've seen this laying around the house, okay? This is a protractor, all right? It's got all these numbers on it, maybe a little hole here, maybe a little cross, a uh, line in the bottom, all these fun things, okay? Uh, you'll see this in a little minute uh, in the uh, Math Antics video, okay? This is a circular protractor, okay? I'm going to zoom in on this in just a moment, okay? So a circular protractor, you see how this starts at zero and goes all the way around there, and you see all these little numbers around there? Those little numbers are called degrees, okay? So <clears throat> if I zoom way in, let me get that way in a Super close up. All right, so here's zero, and I can see that that one little tick up there from there, that is one degree. That is what one degree is. So one degree is one 360th of a circle because each one of these tiny little marks, there's 360 of them all the way around this circle. All right, it's a lot. Yeah, so you might have heard of 360 before if a kid's on like a skateboard or, or something, they spin all the way around and land going the same direction or a snowboard, that's a 360. All right, a 180 would be just turning around going the other way, which is 180 degrees. So a 360 is all the way around and all those little tiny marks that mix up 360. So a big thing that you need to understand today is that one degree is one 360th of a turn. All right, super tiny. Also explore benchmark angles using the protractor. So we're gonna um, kind of, I'm gonna do this for you and uh, so you can understand it uh, because it, was, it would be really hard for me to do what I'm gonna do today with a whole class. So it's just not gonna work out. But we'll be using uh, this protractor and this protractor to talk to you about benchmark angles. All right, 90 degree angles, 45 degree angles, and 30 degree angles, okay? All right, so hang tight. We'll be uh, gonna watch a math antics video and then be back with our problem set.